I said, learn and watch your light, my only friend through teenage nights, and everything I had to know, I had it on my radio. Hello coin collectors, welcome back to another All Change Review. And from the great lyrics of Queen, it leads us into this week's coin, which is the £2 coin to celebrate 100 years since Marconi's first transatlantic transmission. So, as normal, let's start with the value. How much is this coin worth? And again, as normal, it's worth £2. It's still a current coin in circulation, and so has its own face value. But, as a collector's item, I went online, had a look at the last five of these sold from circulation, and they sold for an average of £2.40, which sounds about right for the number minted, which was 4,558,000. And while due to the age of these coins, which is actually now getting on for 15 years in circulation, they still do pop up from time to time. So if you want to add one of these to your collection, I'd just keep an eye out. I'm sure you'll get one soon. So, on to the coin itself. I'm going to start by picking it up and turning it over. And as you can see here, uh, we have the fourth portrait of Queen Elizabeth II by Ian Rank Broadley. Now, as usual, I'll post a link below to the video where I cover off the portraits of Queen Elizabeth um, since circulation. Okay, and then turning it back over, we've just got a clearer image there of the front design. So, just going to put it back down. And... This design here was actually by Robert Evans, a Welsh artist and senior engraver at the Royal Mint. Now, this was actually the first coin to be put to public consultation with three designs put forward and over 13,000 members of the public let their thoughts be known on which of the three designs should be chosen. And the design they went for mirrors the first radio signal and radio waves that was sent across the Atlantic and you can see that just here around the outer rim and in the center. Now in the center here as well we have the 2001 for the year it was minted along with the electricity spark but you can also just make out here on these pulses you've got three dots and those three dots were to represent the Morse code letter of S. And these three dots were the first message to be broadcast across the Atlantic by Guiel Marconi, and not I want to change my name, as suggested by Milhouse. But it's from this very first transmission which proved how far radio waves could travel and they would not have problems due to, say, the curvature of the Earth. Um, but for many years, they continued to be seen as a uh, plaything and a preoccupation for just the rich and the wealthy with no real importance. That is until 1912 when they had the tragic sinking of the Titanic. But due to the Titanic having a Marconi radio on board, they were able to send a distress signal to the Lusitania and from this and the press thereafter, the importance of the radio and radio communication was seen and from there it continued to grow which led to improvements and other forms of communication as well, which we can see right up until till we have our technology today. But as we come to the end of another All Change review, just a bit of housekeeping. There was no quiz this week um, or next week, but that's just to a new item we're going to be starting on the 1st of March. So be sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter to keep posted on that. And until next time, fellow coiners, thank you for watching and keep collecting. Bye.